Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Allie. I am a hunter, an angler, a wildlife conservationist, public lands advocate, lover of the outdoors, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today is Vlogmas Day One. It's December 1st, 2019. For those of you who don't know, what Vlogmas is. I will be posting a video every single day now through Christmas, which means that's 25, 25 videos in a row. It's way more than I have ever posted in a single month. If you have not subscribed to my channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below so you don't miss any of my Vlogmas videos. Abby, girl, she needs to go outside. Let's let Abby out and then we shall continue. You need to help me get some firewood? Ooh. It's been freezing raining all morning. You can see on the trees, there's just like ice over everything. <gasps> you want to play? Come here. I'll throw it for you. Bring it here. <laughs> okay, drop it. Hey, drop, drop. Okay, this is left-handed, so don't make fun of me. Go. Good girl. <laughs> She's strong. Okay, anyways, opening day of rifle deer was yesterday, Saturday, the first time that opening day of rifle deer has ever been on a Saturday here in Pennsylvania which means that there were a lot more people out in the woods, which is a good thing, but also can become frustrating if you're hunting public land. I went out in the morning and hunted from my saddle, which was kind of weird. I wasn't as comfortable as I am with my bow. I just think I need more practice with it. And about 30 minutes after light, there were two guys that came wandering in the woods and just stood on the ground like a hundred yards from where I was set up. And they definitely saw me because I was in Hunter's Orange and so were they. And it's, you know, it's just the way that it goes sometimes on public land, but it can also be a little frustrating. I saw two does. Does are not open right now. It's buck only, so I could not shoot them. So I'll be hunting deer all week and you guys will get to see all of it because I'm vlog missing and uh, I'm excited. If you have suggestions, ooh, let's get this out of the way right now. If you have suggestions of what you would like to see during Vlogmas, please leave them in the comments below. I need ideas. 25 videos is a lot. So I hope you guys enjoy this and let's uh, continue on with the day. So this pellet grill by Camp Chef has been my new favorite Thing. I see people use pellet grills all the time online and I finally have one and I've been having a lot of fun playing with different recipes and cooking things up because everything that comes off a of pellet grill is delicious, I swear. So we found one last remaining miracle roast from my deer last year that I shot here in Pennsylvania on public land on opening day of rifle actually. And I decided to make a little stew. So I started by seasoning the roast with garlic, black pepper, salt, and then the six pepper seasoning blend. I'm just going with whatever the heck I have in the refrigerator because this wasn't really planned. You know, I'm just throwing this meal together. But the first thing that I did was put the smoker at 190 degrees. I threw the roast on there and just let it cook for about 45 minutes. And to be honest, I don't really know if it did anything. I probably should have just pan seared it a little bit, but that's what I did. And then I put it in the Dutch oven. 
All right, so I have here some potatoes, garlic, salt, pepper, butter, and then this liquid is beer. It looks a little foamy because I just poured it in. I'm just gonna take the meat off of the smoker, put it in here, and then put the whole thing in there. So this is going to get a little cold for a second, but that's okay. I'm gonna pick this guy up, plop her in. Hold that. Lock her in. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. so fresh and so clean, clean. I uh, did a little workout, took a shower, did some work, and it is now 7 p.m. So this roast has been in the Dutch oven in the smoker for a little over four hours now. So we're gonna go take a look and see how we did. I am unsure whether or not it's going to be worth actually smoking the Dutch oven. You know what I mean? Because the lid is on and everything, so I don't even think that the smoke is getting to the meat itself. I don't know. Is this a dumb idea? I don't know. Either way, let's go check it out. <gasps> no. Oh, no. I don't even know how long this has been off. <gasps> oh my God, it's cold in here. No. Flame has extinguished clean grill before use. Oh my God, no. I have this, wait. Okay, it's a little warm. I have no idea when that shut off, but it shut off. A while ago. So this is not hot. Crap. <laughs> I hope it still worked. All right. Yeah. All right, let's take a look. I mean, it's still, this is still hot. It's just, yeah, like I'm actually gonna use this just so I can hold it open. Moment of truth. Nope. Not cooked. Dang it. No. Let me see if I can pull it apart. Otherwise, I'm just gonna have to cook it in the oven, which is fine. It can cook tonight and then I can, um, or you know, we can eat it tomorrow. Okay, so. That didn't work, but I'm gonna take a look. Oh, no. No. It's not cooked at all. Okay. Well, the good news is it smells delicious. It just needs to cook. So I'm gonna turn the oven on. Let's see to 275 so the same temperature that it was supposed to be cooking at and i'll let this cook in the oven for maybe like two or three hours and then we're gonna go to bed because we want to wake up early and hunt that's such a bummer now well this is the end of Vlogmas Day 1. <laughs> I really wanted to have a roast to show you guys, but you know, it doesn't always work out the way that you plan. As I'm filming this, I'm working on finishing, editing this video that this clip is in and get it up before midnight tonight. So Vlogmas Day 1 is officially a a success, but also a fail because that didn't work out at all. I have been using the pellet grill a lot. And to be fair, I have never used one before, nor has anyone taught me how to use one. So I may have been using it incorrectly and that's what caused the flame to extinguish. Or maybe the beer was like boiling out over the, like over the lid of the Dutch oven. And that extinguished the flame or 
who knows? I'll research it, clean it. That'll probably be part of tomorrow's vlog or the next day. And hopefully this roast will be a success. But that is it, YouTube. Thank you so much for watching. You got a glimpse of Nick in the background. He's working on the computer. I'm going to finish this video. And I will literally see you guys tomorrow.